Okay, hold on. There's no note inside the box. Oh, wait. There is a note inside the box. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm doing this all wrong here. Okay. I thought this was the same note. For Game Boy and Game Boy Color separated by region and sorted alphabetically. What? That's amazing. What the fuck? Oh my god. Didn't click for me at first either. See, at least one person didn't get it. Everyone else knew. <laughs> Did I didn't I even say, like, look, I got a Game Boy? <laughs> Oh my god. Um, it, welcome to your new game, girl. Color case during lockdown when everyone taught themselves how to bake sourdough bread. I set up an electronics workshop in my garage where I taught myself to repair and modify old game consoles. This console you have here is one of a kind. The only thing original is the main circuit board and CPU of a Japanese Game Boy color unit from 1998. The old non-backlit screen has been replaced with a new backlit TFT screen from a modder in Australia who goes by the name of Ben Ven. I used TFT panel instead of the higher resolution instead of the higher resolution IPS replacement screens because they are much more powerful and efficient. Um, the old plastic screen lens cover has been replaced by a custom UV printed glass game girl color light screen lens by a modern English that goes like that goes by blush squirrel there's a custom holographic label from blush squirrel on the rear console in addition i've replaced the speaker and the surface mount capacitors this is essentially a brand new game boy from the 90s but better what about the games you ask well i've got you covered also enclosed is an everdrive gbx3 flash I feel like I'm reading the Christmas story. Like, all I want for Christmas is my Red Rider BB gun, right? Because I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, I've got you covered. Also enclosed is an EverDrive GB X3 flash cartridge. These are made by an electrical engineer from Ukraine that goes by the name of Kurgs, who now lives and operates out of Spain. This cartridge uses an FPGA chip to emulate the original onboard circulatory of original Game Boy and Game Boy Color cartridges and their mapper chips. It has a 16 gigabyte micro SD card with the entire libraries for each of the consoles separated by region and sorted alphabetically. If it was a game made for Game Boy or Game Boy Color, it's on the cartridge. Your console is essentially a standalone unit. No need to purchase games. What the fuck? This is dope as fuck. This is amazing. Every game ever made? What the fuck? This is so cool. Thank you so much. That's so fucking cool. Wow. Oh my gosh. It says something else. I think it says like on the back of the game cartridge, if you just press on the raised portion that says game, you will feel a slight click. This is normal. There's a tactical switch inside the cartridge that serves as a reset button. If you're playing a game that has a save game feature like Legends of Zelda or Pokemon, after saving your game, press the reset button and let the system reboot into the OS before turning off the console or you will lose your save game. Oh, gotta remember that shit. The cartridge needs to be rebooted to store the save file. Other than that, you will play like standard any game. Wow! This is so cool. This is like, like my friend was like, I got an Atari thing. This is like so dope. This is amazing. I'm so stoked. Thank you so much, Prodigal Man Child. There's still more in the box. There's batteries. 
Hold on. This box? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me put this back in here just in case. This is amazing. And the fact that it came in a dope ass purse. Look at this shit, guys. Batteries included. Look at this shit. That's so cool. I love this. Oops, shit. That's so cool. Fuck yeah. Yeah, that's a fucking present. Holy cow. Yeah, I'm going to play. God damn it. I have so many things to do tonight. I'm loving it. This, this is going to... Thank you so much. It's so nice because this is stuff that will keep me busy. That's different. And I can take it... I can take it outside and I can sit with pork outside. I can take it anywhere. That's so nice. Okay, so let's make sure this doesn't get ruined. Let's go back this way. Because I should definitely save the note. Dang, the bag was cute, right? That's so funny that I didn't get it with Gamer Girl. I was like, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> Sometimes I'm a little not all there. <laughs> okay, hold on. I got to figure out. I don't want to put it near any trash. <laughs> yeah, these multi gifts are so well composed. Some expert, some expert level gifters. I know this is wild. I need to get everybody else some fucking gift gifts. You need a much larger room for all this stuff. Yes. Um. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to turn one wall into all shelves. I think I'm gonna knock the closet out in here actually in like three months and just make it one whole bigger room. <laughs> Color protector. Oh, dang. I got the sling. Oh, you guys are gonna like this other thing. <laughs> Hold on. Scissors. Yeah, three walls of shelves. That's what I'm thinking. It's just tape. It's actually not too bad. Okay, so check this out. Color protector. So I can carry it just by itself with pork outside, which is fucking dope. Because I'm definitely going to use this in the backyard. Micro arcade. Oh my god, this is so cute too. Fuck guys, the smallest fully functional pocket-sized arcade game. Oh my god, it's got Dig Dug on it. It's got Dig Dug on it. This is really a good mindful gift. That's the fucking best. It's Dig Dug. This is the first video game I ever played and it was my it still is my favorite video game, guys. Fucking Dig Dug. <laughs> That's great. Dig Dug was the shit and still is the shit. Dig Dug is great. And I haven't played it in years, so that's going to be so fun. And then <laughs> the world's tiniest boppin. <laughs> I want to open it up and play with it. Hold on, let's see. I'm like, I just got to open it up and bop it once. Just once. Or twice. Or maybe until I have a high score. Who knows? Dig Dug thugging as fuck? Yeah, Dig Dug's the shit. Okay. Guys. Let's see. Solo. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no, my hands are too big! Oh my god, okay. <laughs> <laughs> 